Well, so we're, we're rolling now. Congratulations. You look pretty excited as you came up to the finish line there. Yeah, man. Always uh, love to race with a bit of passion and uh, come to the finish line. Pretty excited. And, um, you know, to do it on this course, the Olympic course, um, it's a little bit different than what it's going to be um, next year. But um, just to do it um, well and execute the race plan to according to plan was, yeah, uh, absolutely fizzing about it. So talk us through that plan and talk us through your race today. So for me it was just to be a bit stronger on the swim. Um, I had a good start and got myself into a good position on the first lap and then it kind of just became a bit of a fight. Um, everyone was kind of just trying to find position. It was real congested and it was just hard to swim and came out and I kind of came out where I'd normally come out so about a minute down for me is not too bad. Um, it's uh, definitely something I want to improve on but um, you know I had to work with what, what I had and I looked around and I had some of the guys that normally work well on the bike with me and um, from the get-go we just put the hammer down and, t and two laps later we caught the front group and it was real nice just to um, have everyone working together and uh, no nonsense and no crashes so that was real good and uh, for me I just wanted to get into transition and execute that as good as possible and I was the first one to get in so I had kind of uh, just relax and um, you know take step by step and not really rush and get into a good pack at the start and you know go out the gate as quick as possible because you know you'll just implode and and um, that's you know it's not the best thing in this heat so um, yeah just try to get on water as much as I could on the bike I went through two bottles and that went perfectly and that's what I was aiming for um, even though if you don't really feel thirsty you're just going to put it down like the sweat was just dripping off the helmet I um, got onto the run and um, it, from, yeah, as I said uh, we just had to go at one pace no surges just keep it clean and uh, from there um, just took every aid station I could just take a water take one down the neck take one down the throat and um, Yep, there's, I think there's about four aid stations, so yeah, it's just getting water, 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 electrolytes, anything you can grab, and just keeping the body cool and the core temperature cool, and um, yeah, that worked out real well. Got to the last lap, and we're like, you know, if we keep this up with, um, you know, this is uh, us three right here, we could get a podium, and I was just like, just got to keep control, don't get too excited, and um, that last kilometre, I looked back, and I was like, all right, we're, we're running for a podium here, and um, went a bit too early, I think, for myself, but I uh, had to drop the boys, because uh, I knew they've got to, uh, some good sprints, and uh, didn't have it in the end, but uh, that, you know, for me, um, the sprint is something I want to work on well. And um, my friend, uh, unfortunately, Sam Tanner has gone to America um, to run. So I uh, don't have my little firepower friend uh, who is also trying to go to the Olympics for the 1500. So, uh, but I think he have to give me some of his Tanner kick. Uh, but yeah. I'm absolutely stoked with the result and happy to come away with oh, third. Well, yeah, you look stoked. <laughs> Throwing your arms up as you crossed the line. You said you were aiming for a top 10 placing. Can you tell us about that? Yeah, for me it was just to have yeah, consistent, uh, try and get into the top two Kiwis. Um, that was uh, the goal for me is to finish either um, around, uh, you know, first or second Kiwi and um, to come through first Kiwi is unbelievable. You know, the boys, you know, Ryan Sisson's, you know, double Olympian. Um, Sam's been having a sensational um, <coughs> um, WTS campaign and um, Taylor Reid's under 23 world champs. So we've got some amazing talent and to come in front of those guys is just, yeah, unbelievable. So, um, yeah, if you're feeling stoked, feeling, you're fizzing. And it's on the Olympic course as well, so you must take a bit of heat from that and good Olympic <coughs> qualification points as well. Yeah, I, um, I guess it puts my um, puts my foot into the door, but it's still not there yet. For me, I want to be more, uh, it's got to be consistent throughout the year until the selection um, comes out. And, uh, you know, it's going to keep, uh, you know, the mind in a good space. And uh, it's nice to have a good result on the Olympic course and, you um, just going to keep building on this and uh, not let it get to my head and just, you know, keep relaxed and, um, yeah, just wait wait until the next few races. World Champs is in a few weeks, so it's another day, it's another race. Different temperatures, different course, and, um, yeah, you just got to keep trucking along and just be consistent and, um, yeah, hopefully we can pull the result and finish good on the um, WTS Triathlon Series. And mixed team relay on Sunday as well, so obviously team's still to be selected for that, but do you take, you know, finishing um, top top three here, I guess, a bit of confidence and yeah. how do you feel about Mixed team relay. Yeah, we've always got a strong mixed team relay no matter what. Um, the girls are, uh, didn't race, uh, well, the uh, two of our girls didn't race uh, yesterday, but Sophie also did, so we've got three good girls ready to go. We've also got um, our three guys ready to go as well, so whatever team we put in, it's going to be a great team. Um, so we're just going to wait this uh, this evening until the team is selected. Um, if I'm not selected for the team, and because uh, we might be you know, trying up a few more things and trying different things um, with the team, you know, just experimenting, um, I'll be absolutely fine with it. I'll be cheering, I'll be down there uh, waiting if one of the boys want to uh, pull out because they're not feeling too well in the morning and uh, yeah just uh, get ready uh, just if I race or not race so uh, I'll be here for the team. Well done and go well. So cheers mate.